So you guys, I have a new apartment. shoes, trainers, and brought all the boots out. So I need to get the rest of the clothes and coats. And that is it. I'm trying to be as minimal as I can. Let's see how this goes. But there's some stuff here that I need to hang up. I've already filled up my drawers with underwear, gym wear, and PJs. Hey guys, hi. I moved in yesterday and I'm ill. And I feel and look like a mess. Nails aren't done, hair is like, just crazy so i'm gonna try and use today to sort myself out and hopefully if i feel and look a bit better i'll start feeling a bit better um i have a nail appointment at or of course at box park <laughs> loves i hope you're doing all right i am slowly but surely getting better i still sound a little bit clogged up but i finally got ready after four days of not getting ready so i'm feeling a little bit closer to myself today though i want to do some furniture browsing and also see if there's anything of my furniture from my previous apartment that i want in here because this apartment is going to be quite neutral but i want to warm it up cozy it up bring in some earthy tones as well. So I'll keep you guys updated. On this really cute vase, it looks really expensive. I think it's like 12.99. I like it. It's fine. Okay, you guys, so I just came in from my Essex apartment and brought some furniture things and I also stopped off at HomeSense and I picked up two different things that I'm not 100% sure on, so we're gonna to decide together whether they are staying or going back tomorrow. So this is the console, love it. I got it for the last apartment, but I actually really got it for the next house, because I feel like this is gonna be really nice somewhere in my next house, so I wanna keep forever, essentially. And then, move this behind this sofa, like this.
good couture of hair coloring because I believe it's very Paris but also worldwide together with explain it but there's a certain vibe of Parisian chic that it's very here or and that is the look I'll be able to show you guys because I don't know if it's like all top secret but I'll try things first guys I already know that five shots that I it smells about well the product and how absurd is this so while everybody's going to be enjoying lunch and one of all you to hear your questions future me that you may Hey guys, so I just got ready really quickly to go over to Westfield and collect a Zara order. When, remember this jacket you guys from River Island? Um, leggings, top, cardi, cap, trainers. So yeah, I'm gonna run some errands and grab myself something to eat and bring it back home and get back to editing. I am back home. And I've got my Zara order, got some little bits from Highmark, some socks, that sort of thing, and a scarf, and a naked blue for my lunch. You know what I should have got? I should have actually got some loungewear, but honestly I just didn't have the patience for Primark looking for sizes and all of that, so I think that will probably be done either on tomorrow or next week when i have the energy because i'm still i sound like 80 percent just got a naked burrito i don't even feel that hungry but i need to eat um tortilla have changed their chicken to this i don't know if it's baked whatever but the oven-y like grilled chicken was so good and this wet stuff like i just don't think i'm feeling it but let me open it and show you guys what I got. So messy. So, chicken. Let me actually taste it. Mm, it's nice. It's not as nice. Salsa, some cheese, sour cream, avocado, extra avocado, hot sauce, um, black beans, salsa, and there is some tomato rice underneath it. So, I'm going to eat this now and then go back to work. Let's get into this Zara box and um, I will probably try stuff on tomorrow. I'm not gonna lie, I don't think I'm in the mood right now. First Zara order in this apartment. We're off to a good start. <laughs> First week of the apartment and we've already got a Zara delivery. I got this pinstripe off shoulder dress which is really cute. I got it in a size small. Come to think of it, actually no. I got it in a small rather than extra small because I didn't want it to be too short. So hopefully it fits quite cute. I was thinking this could be nice with either some black tights and black boots or um, I got these red shoes that are in here. I don't even know why I got this top, but I thought I could wear this with some jeans. I got this denim skirt. I know it's another denim skirt, but it is different to the one I have because guys, look at that cut out look at that it is quite high um but i just saw this was so cute it was the last one there right so i then saw this halter neck top gosh i am in love with halter necks i feel like i said that in my last vlog one of them um this is a small because it's small medium large it was only 15.99 i just think this is a nice piece because even though it's like autumn winter winter sorry it's a halter neck but it's not giving summer because it's furry and i think this would be really nice again with denim with black leather um or paint and again with knee-high boots and some shorts or a skirt this gray jumper which is just a classic kind of cropped one this is really cute feels so soft um this was 25.99 i got this to try on with the black pleated skirt that i'm gonna get it's from bershka or stradivarius then the two shoes that i got i picked up these loafers because honestly i am so tempted to buy a designer pair of loafers my boyfriend bought a dior pair with the dior monogram on them not the whole part just like this part i think it is and i'm obsessed I don't think they come in women's those ones, but they had some other ones that said Christian Dior and Gold. 
Then I saw on the Suffrage's website yesterday these Valentino ones that have a V, you know, because I'm Van Real. I like Valentino for that reason. And they are probably one of the cheaper, like, loafer shoes out of all the designer brands that I have seen so far. They actually had some that looked exactly like uh, Gucci, um, but they were sold out and I didn't really want to get something that looked like they were Gucci when they weren't. The last pair of shoes, they really look so good, are these red patent leather flat toe shoes. These are size six, right? Yes. I mean, I feel like I have to keep these. I don't know if I'm gonna keep everything. I've got to try them all on. But these, with the all black look, In the middle of trying on the clothes, you guys, and look, <gasps> my mirror is here from next. Life is made. Let's do this. So here is the mirror. I am honestly so happy. Some of you may not really see the difference between the, this one and the other one I was just showing you, but the other one is probably like that wide and that short and it makes such a huge difference in terms of the background it picks up how your pictures look even on the vlog now i can actually get my full body on the camera without having to like angle it downwards and look awkward and it fits so nicely with the whole vibe and interior of this space i just love how it's coming together you guys happy saturday talk about lazy i have driven across the road from my apartment to the stratford to take my mum for lunch she's there because it's been on and off raining and i don't want to chance it <laughs> hey mummy so it's here. got our truffle and mushroom pizza with calamari and of course the spicy mugs. Hey guys, so I am dressed. Finally wearing this diesel jacket I bought. I feel like it was a year or two ago. Um, it's coming up quite like pink, but it's not. It's like a nice, like real red. Um, but yeah, I'm going to a uh, boxing match. No, I'm going to a basketball game here in... Um, Stratford and I'm really looking forward to it my first ever one and I'm taking my boyfriend she got the tickets for free so yeah this is what I'm wearing quite basic I really wanted to dress up but I thought you know what it's a Sunday I'm in such a cozy mode and I also just ordered some Jamaican food to the house so when we get back the food is ready so yeah diesel jacket plain white vest from Primark Zara leggings um my croc and grey air forces and my Gucci bag and then lots of jewellery, like LV necklace, Fendi earrings, blah, 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 blah. And then, yeah, there is the food I just ordered from Rhythm Kitchen. I got us both oxtail, rice and peas, plantain and uh, cabbage. So we'll have that when we get back. But it's literally like a five to ten minute walk through the park. So perfect date night. And, um, yeah, I will vlog on my phone. The sun is shining. Wow. <laughs> Thank you.